everyone this is me Sadia here and I'm back with the remaining month of uh, May we start from the 22nd through the 31st of May 2022 this reading is going to be for the sign of Libra so let's see Libra what is coming up for you for the remaining month of May time I will be adding messages from your person and oracle cards and color cards in this read so stay tuned and before I dive into the read let me remind you it is a general read it may, it may not resonate with everyone out there so always pick the signs and messages that resonate and leave the rest for personal reads you can always reach out to me on my email id in the description box you can also check out other services that I offer as well so Libra let's see what is going to happen for you for the many month time let's begin four of cups knight of swords six of cups i do see you waiting for some sort of communication coming your way some sort of message coming your way for uh from a specific someone uh if you are completely single you might be waiting for the right one to come in your life so you could have the life that you wanted to live uh, you know that ideal life the dream life when it comes to your love life I feel like um, for majority of you maybe you have some offers coming your way as well still but you are not ready to take those offers uh, maybe they are not like you know matching what you always wanted to have in your love life as your dream life uh, that could be the case for some of you um, or maybe maybe there is a specific someone that you have on your mind that you want to be uh, with you you might be like you know thinking about that specific someone as well uh but i feel like you know for majority of you you do have you know other offers uh already but uh you are not taking those offers you you really don't feel like taking any offer right now um having said that i do see some offer some message some news coming your way where um unexpectedly you will be able to have the kind of relationship that you always wanted to have um, this offer could be coming from a specific someone from your past it can be an offer from a new person uh, where uh, where you know that person is exactly how you always wanted your life partner to be or your boyfriend girlfriend husband wife to be so there is a possibility of someone like that coming through for you who is going to be exactly how you wanted your partner to be let's see more cards here Yes, I do see somebody coming towards you. Now, for some of you, you might be reaching out to a specific someone from the past, um, but the response that you're going to get might not be as positive as you want it to be. Uh, so there there could be like two options uh, for you as well. Like maybe there is a specific someone from the past and then there is a new offer coming your way. That could also take place during this uh, remaining month time. I do see that, you know... Um, I do see a very stable, stable kind of love offer coming your way. Now, it can be a new person, it can be a boss person for some of you, maybe. It's going to be a boss person reaching out to you to offer you something stable. It can be a new person too, offering you something stable as well. But I feel like, you know, this person, whoever it is going to be, new or the boss one, this person will come unexpectedly. And this person is somebody who has been thinking about you or to make this offer to you. Even if it's a new person, they might be having crush on you. They might be like, you know, keeping eye on you for quite some time already. Maybe they are somebody in, in, in the close circle of your friends and family. Um, it can be, um, you know, a, a person who's, who's always like, you know, having those thoughts for you. Uh, but this time they will be like approaching you with the, with the, with their intention being revealed, uh, why they have been so nice to you. They are going to let you know that, look, I have feelings for you. Can we do this? Can we be friends? Can we be like, you know, dating each other or stuff like that? So somebody is going to be revealing their intentions to you during this uh, remaining month time. We do have eight of swords, but I feel like, you know, for majority of you, you're not going to be like interested so maybe it's going to be a new person coming in uh, approaching you um, because you have some mental physical emotional blocks because maybe there is a specific someone from the past that you are waiting for again I feel like for majority of you you already have offers your way but you are not ready to accept any because there is a specific someone from the past that you are still attached to you are still waiting for that person to show up you are still waiting for that person to express love and then you are keeping your love life stuck so 
I feel like, you know, if you really want your love life to move forward, maybe you need to take this offer and move forward with your love life instead of like, you know, putting yourself in the situation where you're putting yourself on hold and not letting your love life move forward. On either deck, we do have the wall. I feel like things are changing and things will be changing in the remaining month time for you. And uh, maybe, maybe this new person is going to make you feel like, you know, you got to move on with your life instead of waiting on for the boss person. Uh, but yeah, let's see what is the energy of your person towards you be that the new person or the boss person let's see whoever shows up what is the energy of your person whoever it is that you're going to be dealing with what are the energies and the current feelings of that person towards you things are changing things are shifting um i feel like you know if it's a boss person who's coming towards you um Or if you are waiting for the past person, I feel like in for majority of you, you are still stuck on the past person because I do see that this energy here of your person is of the person of the, uh, you know, from the from your past. It's not the new person's energy because I do see that this person is definitely like you know um, busy with their life right now. Uh, deep down, they are still connected to you, but they are not taking any action towards you because they have other things on their mind right now. So maybe they are putting you on hold, on wait, and then you are unable to move on with new people as well because you're still hopeful that this person will give you what you want. So I do see you stuck in that situation right now. Let's see the oracle cards here. Let's see what do you need to do right now in the given situation with your with your love life. Um, what do you need to do right now? What is it that you need to do right now? Expect powerful change. Again, for some of you, you might choose to make this choice uh, where you are going to choose a new person and move forward uh, because somebody is really coming up front about their feelings. They will be revealing that. Not just that, they will reveal their intention as well. It's not going to be like, you know, they're not going to keep anything hidden or secret that, uh, you know, they want to date you, they want to be with you forever. What is it that they want? They will be revealing that to you. Uh, confidence is your key to success. So for some of you, you could be dealing with a with another uh you know libra or a uh, leo as well i feel like you know it's it's very important right now for you to uh believe that you know if something good is coming your way you should not let your past hold you back uh you should like you know take the offer with confidence and believing that this choice that you're making is going to be perfect for you instead of getting worried about it communication is the key um, um i feel like you know you you really have to communicate openly and honestly uh with the one that you are going to be with or the one that you're going to be talking to as well um if if you think that um, for some of you, you might be doing one more thing during the remaining month time where you are going to approach a person from the past telling them that, look, this is what I'm going to do. So do you still want me to stay and wait for you or do you want me to move on? And then you might take that decision of your life as well as what I'm picking up. But I feel like, you know, the open communication is definitely coming in for majority of you, be that with the new person or the past person. Um, let's see the messages from you person. Let's see what do they wish to say to you here. Be that a message from a new person or a past person. Let's see. <clears throat> so we do have two cards here. Let's see the messages from them. I feel so blocked and lost and miserable without you. I miss you so bad. So this is definitely the message from the past person. Um, something is still missing for me, but is that you? So your person is still not sure about it. Like, you know, they do miss you. They do feel lost without you. But at the same time, they are not ready to take any action towards you. That's for sure. So who is this new person? I feel like you know, whoever this person is going to be, uh, they will be have some. They will be having something to uh, offer uh, to you. I feel like the past person is definitely missing here, uh, from the scenario. Uh, so let's see what color is going to be lucky for you for the remaining month time. Lemon. So yep. Excess innovative thinking. Number 23. 23rd of this month could also be a significant date for you. Plus, lemon color is going to be lucky for you as well. Uh, it's very important for you to think through things before you take any major decision about your love life because I feel like, you know, um, you've got to kind of... Uh, uh, keep yourself positive as well in this time when you are to make a decision of your, uh, you know, about your love life right now. Because especially for those of you who are dealing with delays in your love life, it's it's very important for you to make the choice uh, thoughtfully. Like you know, don't keep yourself waiting on for a person who's unsure of you 
as of now so um, you really have to decide do you want to wait more or do you especially if you have this new person already as a choice as an option um, maybe it's high time that you move on with your life instead of like you know waiting on for the boss person who's not ready and not sure about you just yet so um, but yeah your your life your decision but uh, that's what I'm picking up because I do see that the boss person is still having that lack of clarity around the around you and the connection that they feel for you so your call your decision your life but yeah I would definitely not recommend you to wait on for that person for long because their energies is still like you know unsure towards you so that's pretty much it coming up for you for the remaining month time if it was of help do like share and subscribe till i do the next reading for you guys take care bye